Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. Today, we're starting off the vlog. The same place we ended it last night. So if you followed uh, yesterday's video, you might know that Chino came for lessons last night, which meant that Gabby didn't get to ride hops. So last night she was bringing Chino back, just just walk trotting him. And tonight and today she's gonna ride. Look at how look at how soft your eyes are looking. Yeah. So maybe not. <laughs> He's like, hmm. Today she's gonna ride hops because she's gonna show him for Brandon in the show. He's gonna do his first show here at the farm. Right? He's done and he was an inventor. So he know he's been around, he's he knows his way around a show ring. But I hear pooping going on. <laughs> he's like, you will not video me in <gasps> Oh my gosh. Anyways, he knows his way around a show ring. Um, but Gabby's gonna show him in hunters or jumpers, I don't know, hunters I guess. So uh, to do his first show as a school horse. Did you guys know that she's been working on him and so is his other rider been working on him to slow him down and get him to uh, go calmly. Uh, Gabby hasn't ridden him around a whole course yet because she's been trying to keep him slow and slow him down so we're gonna see what happens today. Let's see what happens today. This is gonna be your first day doing a full course on him the day before a show. You've done a full course on him? Oh, I don't know. What do I know? I just film. So Brooklyn and Jacob are coming. This is adorable. Isn't that adorable? That is adorable. Do you think that would fit Brooklyn? I know what size she wears. Literally adorable. Like I love that and it would probably fit her and it's only 10 bucks. I'm gonna buy this. You know why? Because it would fit Gabby too. Oh crap. It's a size small. Gabby wears like an extra small. I love it. That's also children's. No, it's not. It it's a women's. No. I'm gonna go show her. All right, so I'm definitely buying that one because even it will fit Gabby. I just want to double check, see what else there is. I, I have this. Brooklyn could probably wear this even because I have those ones. All right, so Gabby's out there already and she is warming up. I love early morning lessons. Horses are half dead. <laughs> They're like, what do you mean, wake up? Thank you to everyone who was really kind about Gabby's riding lesson with Chino last night, from her from her lesson last night. He, anytime I post a video where the horse isn't like perfect, we always get a lot of unkind comments and I think it's just really hard for people to understand and see horses that aren't in perfect condition. like. He's been off for nine months and we've dealt with a lot of health issues. I cannot wait to make the video, guys. I think you're gonna be shook at all the things that happened to Chino over the last three years that we've had him and all the figuring out we've had to do to figure out what was wrong with him. Like it is a big, huge issue, like a big, huge production it was. Um, I'm just waiting until he's completely, dependably sound always. So we're gonna be building him up and bringing him back but it's different definitely a hard thing to see a horse under muscled and and going out there and building muscles just like watching me run a race would be awful <laughs> would be hard to watch it would be funny sophie says it would be funny <laughs> it would be funny but it's not funny with a horse it's hard to see them struggle and he is like struggling to build himself up and to have that stamina gabby was really careful not to overtax him just to build him a little tiny bit at a time and um, it's worth it. If I've learned anything with Chino, rehabbing his feet and taking the time, taking his shoes off and taking the time to like really rehab them, um, I've learned that taking time is always the right answer. So once he comes fully back, I am gonna make that video. I just, there's some things that I have to say in it. And I don't like to paint other people in a negative light or in a negative way, but there were Lots of times I felt misguided and I felt let down by professionals in our lives. And I don't know how I'm gonna address that kind of stuff. Um, that's why you'll never see me like talking about stuff like that on our channel. So that's a really hard part that I have to like figure out how I wanna say it in a positive way. Thank you so much for the people who posted, commented and said about how, you know, he's looking so much better um, even though he's still under muscled and needs to build up but that notice that his head shaking is so much better without the bit and that 
he is doing better because we don't always get that response. So we're not going to do a lot today. She's just going to jump a course and so she works. He does not really like that one, so you just ride a little bit to that one, okay? So we're just going to have a short lesson. Shoulders and heels down. Good. Outside leg and canter away. Good. Keep that inside leg just working. Allow him to flow forward. Don't get too handsy now. One, two, three. That's okay. That's fine. Keep it just like that. At least it's not the the way that we used to jump. Where we gallop in. Eyes up and just balance. Find the distance. One, two, one, two, one. Leg. Good. Keep that outside leg. Into the corner. Outside here. One, two, leg. Whoa. One, two, three, four, five. That's okay. Remember just a half off a little bit, Gabby. Into the corner, outside leg. Shoulders are back. Whoa. One, two. One, two, three, four. There we go. Outside leg. There, good. Into the corner again. Into the corner. Keep that inside leg, inside leg. One, two, one. Yep, that's fine. One, two, three, four, five. Good. There. Oh, Circle. Outside leg, don't get handsy. And tall body and downwards. Good boy. Make him go good. Inside leg, keep the balanced here. Keep it working. Outside leg, one, two, one. Good, Gabby. Inside leg, hold it still. Outside to hold that haunch in. Tall body, outside leg and look. One, two, Whoa. One, two, three, four, five. Wow. Good. Outside leg. That was pretty. Fix the lead. That's fine. Just hold it through. Hold it through. Hold it through. One, two, one. One, two, three, four. That, that's okay. Wow. He said go and he's like, lady, there is that extra step in here. Good. Inside leg. Don't fake land and pull. Just balance. One, two. Yep, that's fine. One, two, three, four. Whoa. Jeez. Outside leg. Hold it and look. Outside looking. Steering. Oh, oh I, I thought we were done. No, we got the whole jump. We got that whole jump over there still. That's okay. You're so focused. Well, she's trying to live. <laughs> Good. Inside. Remember, don't push him out of that one as much. You really want to sit and drive him, but don't. Whoa. Lift up. One, two, one. There we go. Outside leg. And circle here. All don't, rider don't error. Don't pull the ring. Don't pull the ring. Outside leg. Sit up. Good. And then shoulders and whoa. Good boy. She's probably over. She's probably rethinking that sweater now. I know. I was like, uh. So she gets nervous and she thought he wasn't going to jump this jump over here. Right, so she pushed him. And whenever she pushes him is when he gets kind of crazy. So it's just her finding trust in him. They're still learning each other. Good. Keep this canner. Don't let him change. This tall body weight every single step on it, okay? Yep, that's okay. One, two, three. There we go. Holy right. cow, is that a hunter horse? Keep it in, just like this, the whole time. Inside leg, inside bed. Into the corner, balance. One, two, one. Good. Yep, that's fine. One, two, 
See, Gabby. so much better when she doesn't sit and drive. Go ahead, circle there. Outside, outside leg, sit up. She's like, a, barely had my coffee run, yet. <laughs> I can tell she's exhausted. Good boy. Much better when we don't override. Yeah. Yep. This is the handy hunter round. All but, yep. Yeah. Make sure you get the walk can of transition. Eyes and look, comes up fast. Outside leg. You fold the, yep, yeah. good. Where are we going? Quarter line. Okay. Folding that outside. One, two, one. Good. Wow. Steady, just like that, Gabby. Rolling back to purple, so hold them out a little longer, okay? Outside leg. Outside leg. Outside, one, two. That's fine. That's fine, just, yeah. Hold them so you get that outside leg. Hold that right leg. One, two. Whoop. Good save. Inside leg, wait. One, two. Good and whoa. Good boy. Single officer. Make sure you get the straight line. Whoa, this inside. One, two. There we go, Gabby. And tall body, make him walk. Good. Good boy, huh? Leg, top body, kick, kick, and go. Yep. So she's just schooling over this last jump. The handy. Yep, make him go. Outside leg, hold it, and then can her wet. Good, there we go. Keep your shoulders tall. Don't close it and arch your back to do the transition. Stay up nice and tall. Just hold that right leg. Keep that inside feel for the step. Okay, that's okay. Hold it, outside leg. Yeah, come in one more time. One, two, leg. Yeah, outside leg. Good, whoa. Outside, look, look. Outside, outside, outside. Outside, one, two, three. There we go. Good. It's gonna be a hard show. <laughs> it's gonna be a hard show. Good job. Do you find them different? I was pretending that I was going to ride straight, so then I started riding straight. Always ride straight. And then going to the oxer. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh my gosh, you guys. We are home. Gabby's air freshening air around. Yeah. <laughs> essentially. <laughs> okay, enough. It's going to me. Essentially, essentially, Ow, our, we had to switch our dog's food okay. because the kind that we've been buying isn't available anymore. Like so we ended up having to switch their right. food yesterday and Daisy has diarrhea like so bad. Anyway, we just got home from Gabby's lesson. We are going to pick up the grandkids. It's like a two hour, it's a drive. It's an hour there, an hour back. We have to, come on little girl, come on. So now we're there, an hour back and we have to ride, bathe ponies. So I left him home. He had a lot of things he had to do. One of them is like a horse, or he has a doctor's appointment. But I thought he was gonna work on the barn. He didn't work on the barn at all. Well, that's frustrating. I don't even know where he is. Come on, Zoe, Zoe, come on. Uh-oh, I lost her. I washed the floor three times today. Zoe, uh-oh, come on, come on. I'm right here. Where are you? Oh, she's afraid of the dog. Come on. Don't you worry about that dog. Come on, Ollie. Ellie, no. Don't scare my goose. Yesterday we discovered that the barn has a leak. Somebody suggested that it's coming from underneath the ground. I don't know how it will come up through cement. But it's still wet and it didn't rain last night. I love the pitter-patter of goose feet. I'm super active all the time and I'm super driven and 
not everybody is the same. Sam works really hard for us and he works at his own speed that he's comfortable with. It took me a while to figure out that I have to accept people for who they are and let them do things their own way. So I've become used to not having things done on my time schedule, but just allowing the process. And even though it's disappointing that he didn't have time, I don't even know like what his schedule was like, to be honest. I don't know, like I thought he came home and was gonna do some work and then go to the doctor, but he could have left right away, who knows. Anyways, it's gonna get done. It's a busy weekend when it's busy like this. I have to allow us to just step back from what the projects that I want to get done and just enjoy our life. Like the grandkids are coming. Come on up. She hates, she's scared of the dogs. You want to go for a little swim before we have to go in? Because I'm leaving again. Come on, let's go for a swim. You might as well go for a swim too. We know you want to. <laughs> she's like, oh, I want to swim. I have to go up there and clean? Let's send Gabby. <laughs> All right, so uh, we're at lessons and everybody's getting excited for the show and everybody's talking about the show and everybody's like, it's like high energy and everybody's ready and, and we're driving home and Sophie says, I want a show. Yeah, so then- I said too late. No. <laughs> so then they start talking about it and Gabby's like, yeah, like, you should do hack on storm and Sophie's like, yeah, I really want to do it. And Elizabeth was in the car with us on the phone. He's in Western mode though. He's going to be like going so slow. So I messaged Brandon and I said, do you think Sophie could do hack on storm? Cause storm usually is really good at hack. And he said, yeah, get Gabby to give her a lesson tonight and call out all the things and see if she remembers them and see how storm does. If storm tolerates it and wants to do it. Then let her do hack. So then Sophie starts freaking out and she's so excited. And she's like, can I do hack? So anyway, Sophie's doing hack. Yeah, I know, because she texted me. Did she? Yep. Hopefully Sophie's doing hack. We're gonna go and we're gonna see. So we gotta go pick up the grandkids, come back. We gotta do all the show prep and the girls both have to ride. Jeez, you're busy. <laughs> I know. After the horses come home and we have like a minute to settle down after the horse show, <laughs> I'm gonna get Sam, we're gonna move that brooder up to the front here and I'm gonna get Sam to make a con a, an enclosure in the back just the right size for a duck and a goose so that they can come out here at night. I'm also going to clean the chicken coops and the, both chicken coops right now uh, before we go pick up the grandkids because Lord knows I'm not going to have time to do it once the show showing starts. With any luck, Sophie's going to show Storm. Two people are going to show Gracie and Gabby's going to... like We got a lot of showing going on, you guys. We went from hardly showing to a lot of showing. Don't you know that you're beautiful?